welcome back to my channel. My name is Mackenzie with the double E. Today we're going to be filming a really fun video. As you can see, my room is really messy, but I'm going to be going over everything with you guys today just to show you what I'm taking to college. If you guys follow me on Instagram, then you will know that I recently just made the Oregon State University cheerleading team. So this upcoming fall, I'll actually be a transfer student at OSU. And I'm super excited to get there, meet my teammates, and just indulge in college life again. I have been attending a community college here in my town, and I'm super excited just to get back into university life. I previously lived in a dorm room, so I kind of know the gist of like what to take and what not to take um, because this is not my first rodeo and I'm not transferring in as a freshman. Um, I will be a junior in college, um, so I'm really, really excited about all of that. So without further ado, let's just dive into my college dorm hall. For starters, everybody knows that you're going to have a twin extra long bed, so I picked out my bedding. Um, obviously my color scheme is going to be the exact same. I'm a very pink, black, gold, and white type person. I picked out this super cute bedding. I got my comforter from Target. It is brand Shabby Chic. It's like a blush pink. It has like a crochet trim on it. It's super cute and the material is really nice. It's really thick and I know that it's going to keep me warm. Um, I get cold super easily. I also got this super cute white fluffy pillow. It is going to be um, like a little decoration, sit on my bed along with a couple other pillows that I got. This mattress pad is 18 ounces. It's actually made by the company, The Cloud Company. It is really, really comfortable. It's padded. Um, I actually have like an egg crate foam and I'm also getting a like two or three inch memory foam pad. So that way it's like triple the comfort. The next thing is your sheets. So I got black because obviously my colors are pink and black. This entire set right here is like a microfiber. It's really, really soft. This one comes with a flat sheet, a fitted sheet, and then a standard pillowcase. The next thing that I got was this black, like minky body pillow cover. And then I got this black satin pillowcase. And then I got a two pack of the blush satin pillowcases. So next we have blankets. Uh, I'm the type of person that has an excessive amount of blankets, pillows, and socks, um, but you can never have too many, right? So the first blanket that I got was just this twin full blanket. This one we got from Target. The next blanket it's this cute, large Victoria's Secret blanket, so it's exactly like the one that I have on my bed now, but it is pink and it's got these adorable little cherries on it, and it says pink on it as well in red right there. And then it is Sherpa line, so it is going to be just like this one where it's got Sherpa on one side and then it's got the pattern on the other. Next blanket that I got, oh my goodness, I'm obsessed with it. And then on one side, it is just a little bit more toned down. This side has a lot more fur. The last one is this really cute little throw blanket. It's pretty beachy. It does have like a little fringe here. It is off-white and it's got two tones of pink. These last two blankets I actually got from Home Goods. Next, we're going to talk about this hamper that I got. Of course, it is pink and then it comes with a little black separate lingerie bag. I also just went ahead and got these Sleek Intimates. It's got a bra wash bag and then a lingerie wash bag. So these are just essential to get so that way you're not losing you know, your underwear, especially um, in wash machines that are not your own. It's just a good way to kind of wash them, keep them all together, and keep them in better condition. Next we are going to be talking about bathroom supplies. I have not gotten everything for my restroom yet. For the bathroom that I have already, I got this really cool little soap saver. It does come with two. My mom has the other one. Um, and I have this little pink one. So you actually put the bar of soap in here and then it acts as like a loofah. I personally use a body wash, but I use a bar of soap for 
my more sensitive areas so like my armpits my face and then I also got multiple sets of towels I got these gigantic towels from Target and then I went ahead and got this one for my sink for when I wash my hands um, when I brush my teeth things like that so it's just gonna hang by my sink and then I also got these washcloths they're super soft these ones I actually got from Marshalls it came in a pack of six and then that's all that I got for the bathroom so far next we're gonna talk about a couple of miscellaneous items and it's so clever I don't know who thought of this but whoever did props to you um, so this is the do camp London expandable travel backpack suitcase and it's got so many different pockets and it's got these pockets in it like a regular suitcase and then it is actually expandable so if you have obviously more items than what this regular size can fit it expands opens up to make it like bigger so you can fit all of your essentials in here I'm really excited that I found this as soon as I found it I was like I need it. Next, we have travel packing cubes. Lastly, it's this Pure Steam Portable Fabric Steamer. Just a better idea to um, have something that could possibly take that away rather than like hanging stuff on the shower and then letting the shower steam because I've tried that before, it does not work. Now we're gonna be getting into more school essentials. So the first one that I have is this Nike lanyard. I don't know if you can see the writing on it, so this has the beaver and the little OSU and then the other side is the beaver and it says Kenzie on it and then down here it's got Benny the beaver this one is extremely essential again probably not for everybody but for me this is just a cute little bag it says Kenzie on it it's got a beaver and then it has this little symbol over here which symbolizes um, my medical needs so this is my medical bag uh, my favorite items okay so I ended up going to the Tahone Outlets and I went to the store Kate Spade. The first item that I got from Kate Spade is this Spaniard wallet. So this is going to be perfect for like everyday occasions. The next item that I got is my big purchase. I'm so excited about it. It's my brand new backpack and of course it is light pink. I'm obsessed with this bag. It's really hard to get into. It still has all the paper in it because it didn't give me any of the ones that were on the floor and brought me out this brand new one that was just shipped to them. So it's literally in the plastic and everything. And then I also um, have these two little bottles here. Um, I do have a Kate Spade purse that my mom surprised me with and she wanted to make sure that I had a wallet to go with it just because I had received a wallet a couple of years ago now. Um, has some really tough memories attached to it, so she didn't want me to be thinking of those things every time I opened my wallet. She decided to buy me a matching wallet to go with my Kate Spade purse, um, and we got that at the outlet as well. And she kind of surprised me with that purchase. So we just went ahead and got the leather cleaner and leather conditioner to keep everything in mint condition. Um, the next miscellaneous item is this thing called the Cool Queen. It's an ice pack. My grandma used to have these when she was younger. As a cheerleader, ice packs are extremely essential. So I believe I got this from Marshalls. The last miscellaneous item is just these cute little hair ties. And then I also got more of these like satin silk hair scrunchies because they work with curly hair and my hair has been extremely curly lately, so yes. Next, I'm gonna be going through all of my school supplies. I got these from a bunch of just different places, so as you guys know, I'm obsessed with my hobby planner. If you guys watched my back to school school supply haul that I did last year, um, you will know that I did in fact talk about the happy planner. For my planner, I obviously last year got thousands and thousands of stickers, so I still have a ton of those. And then I went ahead and got this week's goals. I also bought these Get Social pages, which just says which account it is, top number of likes, the number of comments, the number of new followers, and then it just basically has everything that you want to post for like the week. The next thing that I got is a super cute pencil pouch. It is white, black, and gold. 
Um, it's a Kate Spade one. I like this one because it's flat. It also comes with a Kate Spade ruler, two Kate Spade pencils, which I don't really use these pencils, but it came with that anyway, so whatever. It comes with a gold pencil sharpener, as well as a cute little Kate Spade eraser. I got these pens. These are fringe pens. There's a pink, a purple, and a blue. Um, the pink one says, this girl can. The blue one says, the future is ours. And the purple one says, this is my story. I also got this adorable Kate Spade set. Um, these are binder clips. So I guess the theme this year is Kate Spade because everything that I got is pretty much Kate Spade. But these ones are um, also multicolors. There is a green with a blue clicker. It says from the desk of. There is a purple with like a red clicker and it says so well composed. There's a red with a purple clicker and it says to whom it may concern. There's a pink with an orange clicker. It says yours sincerely. And then the last one is like a more of a turquoise um, with a green clicker and it says, what's the word? And if you were wondering whose thumb that is in the video, my mom is helping me film this. So <laughs> lastly, I got this awesome Kate Spade pen. It is so pretty and it's like one of those old school pens where you like click a color and then you click another color and it's a multi colors in one. It has silver, white, turquoise, and green ink. And that is it currently for my school supplies. So this next one is a huge essential, especially for me. This one is the Filtrate Air Purifier. There's no time to be sick in college. So I went ahead and got this air purifier. I do have asthma. I have allergies. This one is amazing. It captures the dust and lint, dust mite debris, mold spores and pollen, which is great for me being highly allergic to molds, pet dander, smoke and smog, bacteria, PM 2.5 exhaust particles, and also ultrafine particles as well as viruses. Especially with like corona going around, um, there's also other viruses though, bronchitis, mono, the flu, colds, um, a bunch of different things so this is like the perfect thing to do. I also went ahead and just bought the most expensive filter for it because this filter um, captures the dust and lint, the dust mite, the mold spores and everything else. There are other ones that don't do as much but I wanted to make sure that I was fully protected in all aspects, so I got this. I went out and got this awesome little desk. You can lift it and raise it as much as you want, and then you can kind of just sit here and like take notes. So I just think this is really clever and the perfect college essential. The last thing that we're gonna be getting into for my room is going to be my decor. So I got this amazing chair. Um, it is like the spring collection. I bought it from Hobby Lobby. This matches my decorative pillow for my bed to a T, hair and all. And I've always wanted a chair like this, so I bought it. The next thing is this Cool Mist Ultrasonic Aroma Diffuser. This is really awesome, especially because it makes your room smell really good. Um, along with like Febreze and things like that because you're not allowed to have candles So I definitely recommend everybody goes out and gets themselves a little like aroma diffuser. They're awesome Now we're gonna talk about This desk storage. I bought this to use for makeup at typical girly girl Next I got this cute earring and ring holder. This is a white ceramic. It's a giraffe I am obsessed with giraffes and then it does have golden hearts on it and I got this from Kohl's and then the next thing I got just says hello gorgeous it is a brush holder it's also white ceramic with gold letters so everything matches my color scheme the last little thing that I got 
is this super cute storage caddy. It has these little handles where you can lift it up and it has golden eyelashes on it. So if you open it here, it actually has a little white tin on the inside. And then deeper on the inside, it has different deep compartments. Next, we're gonna be talking about what's gonna be going on my walls. I don't have much. The first thing, though, is this cute sunglass cork board. This was already pink, but we went ahead and just put glitter on it because it was kind of splotchy in certain spots where you could like see where it was kind of like messed up or something. I got this at Hobby Lobby as well. And then it has this adorable little Rayvon symbol up here, which my mom and I actually used the Cricut. We cut it out and we Mod Podge it on. And then we made them look like actual sunglasses and it turned out so great. So I can't wait to put some cute pictures on this with my friends that I make in college. The next thing I got was also from Hobby Lobby. It's actually this LED light box mini calendar and then it just comes with like all the months, all the days and then it also has these really cute things where it says like three days till and then this one says vacay. It also comes with them that says rose all day, best year ever, weekend vibes, sweater weather, summer lovin', forever busy, it's your birthday, no bad days and then blank days till. The next thing that I got for my wall is this getting stuff done. This is like a rose gold instead of just gold so it goes with like the pink and the gold theme and it also just has like week of and that's what I would put here and then it says getting stuff done. comes with a dry erase marker as well as it has like that built in eraser and then it has two magnets and then it has Monday through Sunday. So it's just a cool way that I can kind of just keep track of my schedule along with my planner. The last decor that I have for my room is just this really cute pink picture frame. So this one is a heart. I can go ahead and put a picture of anything that I want, anything that I love. And then the last thing is a miscellaneous item I forgot to include. Um, and it's just, bright orange locks. I'm gonna go ahead and put these on my cheer bag or on obviously my luggage backpack, um, anything that I kind of need to lock up. Uh, these come in handy. The very last thing I got that I forgot to include with my bedding is my extremely hairy, extremely pink body pillow. That is it for today's dorm haul video, but go ahead and stay tuned for part two where I'll be showing you my brand new wardrobe for college and all the new makeup I got for cheer. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a big thumbs up, and follow me on Instagram if you don't already, at XOXO underscore Kenzie with a double E. That's gonna be in the description below. XOXO.